By popular demand, we're going to be talking about the Studio Ghibli short films. I just so happened to have come into possession, through various means, of a collection of Studio Ghibli short films. This collection mostly consists of commercials, a few trailers, some music videos, and a few short films with a range of many different styles, from traditional 2D animation to experimentations in 3D animation, rotoscoping, maybe even a few stop motion animations snuck in there. It's kind of hard to talk about all of them because there's so many varieties of them, but I can talk about some that really stand out. For example, there is a music video in there called On Your Mark, that tells the tale of two police officers finding an angel and trying to save her from some horrible scientific experimentations of sorts. And the music video has kind of a run Lola run or a game over restart video game type style to it where we see all the different possible ways the rescue fails until they finally succeed in the end. Beautifully well done animation, love it. There's also Space Station Number 9, which is a real prevalent short series of animations that mostly is centered around this one girl in space and all sorts of other surreal and way trippy man type of imagery going on there. On this copy, there are also some behind the scenes for a lot of these shorts. Unfortunately, since this is a bootleg copy, there are no subtitles for it, so I have no idea what they're talking about. Some of my favorite of the short commercials are the rice curry ones. Oh my gosh, is the animation gorgeous here. Just fills you up with that warm sense of mmm, curry. And there's also a number of cute ones, such as a growing house and animals piling inside of it. There's one with a little guitar girl in a city full of bugs, which is kind of cool. As well as all the different uh, short commercials for the logo design of the old Studio Ghibli pig mascot. Oh yeah, there's our uh, spot the pig moment right there. But these aren't the only shorts that Studio Ghibli has done before. There are these two short 12 minute animations called the Ghiblis, which is kind of a comedic behind the scenes of the creators and animators of Studio Ghibli. Short, sweet, and cute. Another short animated film, only about 20 or so minutes long, that's called Night of Taneyama Gahara. Try to say that 10 times fast. The entire movie is presented in the Tohoku dialect. The Tohoku region is located in the northern part of Honshu, and the dialect itself is very difficult to comprehend for speakers not from that area, aka way, way down in Louisiana, for a comparison and set to a montage of images. There's barely any music in it and barely any animation to it. It feels more like a kamishi bai than it does a film. And you might be asking, what in the world is a Tane Yamagahara anyway? Well, um, from what I could gather, it's a little bit unclear. It's been described as a plague that blankets the sky, but it's also a location in the Honshu region. The film starts out with three men huddled around a campfire talking about the weather. The simple conversation and the quiet atmosphere really sucks you in. They hear a horse and go to investigate, while one guy seems to have eaten some bad berries and has a weird dream. Tree spirits come to him, and the guy asks the tree spirits if he will get a certain plot of land he's been seeking after, and if he has cut the grass today or not. The tree spirits say that they will tell him, but only if first he does the can buy dance, and if he promises that if he gets the land that he will not cut down any trees. And this guy is a carpenter, so that's kind of counterproductive to what he wanted to be doing with that land. The whole short feels like an episode of Old Reading Rainbow, like type of storybook style with one single narrator doing the voice of all the people 
except for the spirits, which are done by a choir of children. Very surreal. Other than that, there are a huge number of short films that you can only view at the Ghibli Museum. Those include The Whale Hunt, Coral's Big Day Out, May and the Kitten Bus, Water Spider Mon Mon, The Day I Harvested a Planet, Looking for a Home, Mr. Doe and the Egg Princess, A Sumo Wrestler's Tale, and Treasure Hunting. Maybe someday I'll be able to go to the Ghibli Museum and view these shorts, but until then, I'll catch you next time where we get back to the filmography of Studio Ghibli.